Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon. Um, today we're gonna go almost straight to the Cerulean Gym, but first there's a couple of um, evolutions that I want to take care of. So if we take a look at my Pokemon, I did grind a little bit um, this episode. So you could see um, Bellsprout is up to 20, so he evolves at 21. Pidgey is up to 17, and he evolves at 18. And then uh, Mankey, Pikachu, and Nidorino all had a couple of level ups along the way. So we'll start off with, let's go ahead and go in our TM bag. Um, I want to grab Bullet Seed. So we're going to go ahead and use Bullet Seed on um, Bellsprout. Partly because I accidentally deleted um, Vine Whip. Same thing I did with Nidorino. Um, so we're going to go ahead and learn Bullet Seed and forget um, Growth just because we don't really need Growth. So, absorb bullet seed. There we go. So now we have a decent grass type attack. Um, secret power. What can we teach Rock, Rock Tomb to? Only Mankey? Okay, well, we won't teach that to Mankey just yet. Um, so let's go ahead and get out of that. Now, question Where is that Moonstone? Moonstone. So we can use this Moonstone on somebody. On somebody so let's go ahead and get ourselves a Nido King um, I thought I was gonna use a Moonstone on Clefairy but actually what am I doing I want a Nido King so um, yeah let's go ahead and get ourselves a Nido King like pretty early in the game um, but Nido King is definitely like one of my favorite Pokemon from Gen 1 so this is something like you know I have to get you know as soon as possible here so this is super sick all right, we get ourselves a Nido King. All right, now this is definitely something I'm gonna be using throughout the game. I'm trying to learn Thrash, but can't learn more than four moves. Delete a move? Yes. Also, while I was leveling up uh, Nidorino, I learned Horn Attack, so that's pretty cool. But we're gonna go ahead and get rid of Focus Energy, and we're gonna learn Thrash. And Thrash. So now all of a sudden, Nido King is a very good Pokemon again. After I accidentally uh, got rid of um, something, I forgot what I got rid of already. Low memory. Okay, very cool. So we got our Needle King. Let's go ahead and take a look at him one more time. And then let's go ahead and get. Um, yeah, that's super sick. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, evolve our Bell Sprout and our Pidgey. Get those two evolutions, and then we go straight to Cerulean here. I have running shoes. Well, I read it to Fainted. Level 21. Alright, and something magical is happening. We are evolving our Bellsprout. And I'm really glad I caught the Bellsprout at level 14. So we, we caught it at a pretty decently high level for where we're at. So the evolution over uh, wasn't terribly long. I didn't have to train it for that long. All right, your bell sprout evolved into Weepin' Bell. Pretty epic. Okay, let's go ahead and move Pidgey up front. Let's go ahead and evolve Pidgey, and then we'll go to Cerulean City. And Pidgey's in the same boat, very close to 18 here, so um, the kind of matchups are a little bad here because the squirrels are kind of hard to take down. But level 18. What? Pidgey's evolving? Nutter, dude. Alright, we got ourselves a Pidgeotto. Congrats, your Pidgey evolved into Pidgeotto. Cool. Alright, let's head back to town. That is all the things that I wanted to do uh, before our Cerulean fight. Um, and I'm gonna I'm gonna try to incorporate a lot of our Pokemon into the gym. I know again Most people just kind of stomp their way through with their starter um, But I really wanted to make a point of the series to not do that. I There's a hundred and fifty one Pokemon man. You, like let's 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 expand our horizons a little bit past Blastoise and Charmander and Bl Charizard, you know Yo, champ in the making, let me give you some advice. The leader Misty is a pro uses water type Pokemon. You can drain all of their water with grass type Pokemon. You might see 
Or you might use an electric type Pokemon and zap them. So I can use Pikachu or Bellsprout. But, so actually, let me go ahead and, um... Let me... Why don't we put in Needle King? We just, we just got Thrash, and Needle King is an evolution. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's see what Needle King can do. Splash, I'm first up. Let's do it. I think there's only two trainers in this whole building area, so it shouldn't be that hard in the first place, but... Alright, who are you gonna use? Horsey? And, of course, we can't get any water Pokemon until we get... Oh, that's a pretty cool sprite. Until we get, um... A rod. Oh, that's a pretty good move. I mean, maybe not, because I didn't kill a level 16 Horsey, but... But that's... Fine, it worked, so no problem. But he's shoulder. Another cool Pokemon. Um, which I will not be able to get, I'm pretty sure. I think it's an exclusive to Fire Red. Oh. Okay, I am confused. Oh cool. Even in my confusion, I can still use Thrash. Tackle. That's not gonna do much. Can I still use Thrash? Amazing. Thank you, Needle King. You absolute baller, dude. I could also just use Horn Attack, but... This can't be. Only 64? Bro, this man's cheap! Alright. What are you... Uh, what? You? I'm more than good enough for you. Misty won't have to be bothered. <laughs> Alright, bud. Alright, Picnic or Diana? Goldine? Well, I like mine better. Let's go ahead and uh, double kick it. Double kick it in the fin. Alright, Water Sport. That's fine, I guess. Fire's power is weakened. Well, that's cool to know. Use Horn Attack? That's pretty good. Tail Whip. Cool. Thank you, Goldine. Appreciate it, bud. There we go. Alright. On to... Misty. Let's see. Hi, you're a new face. Only those trainers who have a policy about Pokemon can turn pro. What is your approach when you catch and train Pokemon? My policy is an all-out offense with water-type Pokemon. Alright, let's do this. Leader Misty would like to battle. Sent out Staryu. That's a pretty cool Pokemon you got there, bud. I wish I had one of those. Um... I don't know, is fighting good against Psychic? I always forget. Seems like... I don't... It's not... It's not super or... Okay. Alright, that's cool, I guess. Let's horn attack it. Super Potion? Oh, I forgot she can do that. Ah, oh, okay, that's fine. Ah, let's do two horn attacks in a row. Yeah, I can't wait until I get a Starmina Staryu. But I think I need to get a pretty decent rod for that. Which makes me a little sad, but that's fine. Uh, you know what, we will switch out Pokemon. Let's, let's go ahead and bring in Weeping Bell. Let's see what our new Grass type can do. Now, Bullet Seed probably won't be super strong. Oh, but they're, they're matched to levels, so... Really, this should work pretty well. Ooh. They still hurt a lot for not being super effective, to be honest. Right, let's hit it with some seeds. Okay, not super, super strong, but... Strong enough to kill it in two... Three turns, maybe, because it didn't hit a third time. It's a pretty. That's a. It's a. Oh, it confused me. It's a strong Starmie. Okay. Oh. Okay. Cool. One more. It's not gonna kill it though. Yeah. Oh. Before Bullet Seed? You're nuts. Okay, dude, Weeping Bell, an absolute clutch. 
Oh, that's a lot of XP. Wow, you're too much. All right, you can have the Cascade badge to show you beat me. And $2,100, dude? Cascade's badge makes Pokemon up to level 30 obey. That includes even outsiders you got in trades. There's more. You can now use cut anytime, even out of battle. You can cut down small trees to open new pathways. You can also have my favorite TM. Um, okay. I don't know what that TM is. Teaches Water Pulse. Oh, that's good. You can use that on Aquatic Pokemon. Okay, I'm gonna keep that for a little while. Yeah, I don't know how when I can get a Starmie, but, um... Mm, we'll see. I just won't teach it right now. That's fine. And did she say up to level 30? Um... Dude, I can't train my War Turtle much more because he's like level 27 or something. So, um... Yeah, I have to be careful here. What is my War Turtle at? 27, yeah, he can't go much higher. So, I just probably just won't... I'll just end up just not using him for a little while. Which is like the easiest way to do this. Because, you know, they don't want me to get the third evolution before the third gym, you know? Um, okay, well, he's letting me inside now, so that's cool. Team Rocket must be trying to dig their way into no good. Okay, that's a move. Those miserable rockets, look what they've done to my house. They stole a TM for teaching Pokemon how to dig holes. I was going to use it on Mankey or Sandshrew. That cost me a bundle, it did. I feel like you could probably teach him without a TM, but... Hey, stay out. It's not your guard. Hey, I'm innocent bystander. Don't you believe me? All right, we got battles right away, right after leaving town. All right. You got two Pokemon. First one is Machop. We'll keep Nero King out for a while. Um, no. Let's use... Let's use Thrash. That's fine. We'll be able to beat it pretty quickly here. All right, focused up but you're about to die pretty quickly, so. Fair enough. Drowsy. Yeah, let's go ahead and uh, switch in Mankey. Let's get Mankey some levels, huh? All right, Drowsy, you're about to get karate chopped, bro. Critical hit. Oh, but it wasn't very effective, was it? Okay. Alright, well, I can't use Karate Chop, but not like I wanted to use it anyway. So let's just go ahead and scratch him. <laughs> yeah, that'll... Confusion, that's not good. Oh, that's very not good. Um... Let's go ahead and switch out. Let's go to Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto probably needs a couple more levels. Headbutt. Ow. Alright, quick attack. Will it kill it? Good. Oh, and it's critical. That helped quite a bit. Pidgeotto gained 186 XP. Very cool. Okay, I'll return the TM I stole. Recovered... Oh, I got dig? I better I better get moving by. We got dig for that? That's cool. Alright, I don't want to hop back into town, and I can't go that way, so... Um, down to Vermilion we go. Um, anything over here? No? We could... Can... Okay, let's jump these fences, I guess. Okay, Route 5. Where are we at here? Alright, can we catch anything new on Route 5? We can catch a Meowth! Okay, we will be looking for a Meowth here, then. I do want one of those. Meowth, as I say it. Alright, so we're not going to use it, but I definitely want to catch it. Let's go ahead and, um... I'm going to kill it with this. Bring in Pikachu. Yeah, if I, u if I hit it with Nidoking, King, it's going to die. Okay, and they're like the same level, so that works, too. Maybe I can even paralyze it just to make it that much easier. Ouch. 
There we go. And it's in the red. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, get a little Pokeball out. We only got six of them. We don't have too many. But I could definitely buy more. We actually made a considerable amount of money as of recent because we took a lot of fights. All right, Meowth. There we go. And... It doesn't look like we're going to catch another Pokemon for a little while. The, the next route does not have anything. The next route doesn't have any new Pokemon. And then it's Vermilion City. A door is around objects. It wanders the streets on a nightly basis to look for drop loose change. Okay, so... Let's go ahead and continue on. Um, there's no... Again, there's going to be no other new Pokemon. So we don't really need to bother looking for any more. Let's try and make sure not to jump off here on accident. I run the daycare service. Would you like to be raised to raise one of your Pokemon? Um. Yes. Oh, okay. Well then, let's go ahead. Let's grab a. Go ahead and take Mankey for now. Fine, I'll look after your Mankey for a while. Come see me in a while. Alright, well then, in the meanwhile, let's go ahead and grab uh, a new sixth Pokemon while we leave Mankey here. Um, what am I feeling here? What, what's like a decent level we can actually maybe use? Okay, all of these are basically poop. Let's withdraw Geodude. Alright. Alright, let's keep moving. We will come get Mankey later. When he'll have plenty of levels. Okay, so I'm guessing I can't go through here, right? Something will stop me? I'm on guard duty. Gee, I'm thirsty though. Oh wait, there's the road's closed. Okay, so. Can't go through him. Do you have a Nidoran? Want to trade it for my Nidoran? Uh, nope. I actually have both because I spent the time to get the what is it the one percent Nidoran mail so um jokes on you I don't need it um I've even got a Needle King so definitely don't need one people often lose things in the darkness of the underground path so basically telling me to click around because you might find something but all right route six um, what's up here? Oh, that's just the guard? That was really dumb. Why can't I just go past that road? Okay. Um, I'm not gonna actually find any Pokemon, because like I said, there's nothing new. Um, but I will fight these people just to gather some more monies. Weedles. Um. I'm gonna do a Thrash, but I might bring out Pikachu. Or no, I might bring out Pidgeotto. Caterpie. Oh, I should have clicked yes. I'm like, my brain is thinking without me. That's why we just keep thrashing him. Needle King can get a little bit more XP. Yes, let's bring in Pidgeotto. Let's get Pidgeotto a couple levels here. What? Did I... Uh, okay. That's fine. Needle King can just go through all three of them. Not a big deal. Okay. Maybe, let's go ahead and, um, maybe, let's bring Pidgeotto up front. Is this going to be a dual battle here? Excuse me, it's a private conversation. Oh, maybe it's, they didn't have dual battles in the remakes, so I think it might have been later in, like, Gold and Soul Silver that they introduced it, maybe? Okay, Gust. Hyper Fang? Ooh. That's gonna hurt. Quick attack. Man. These trainers are getting a little better. Alright. Good job, Pidgeotto. I'd use Pikachu. Okay, let's switch out, because Pikachu's not a... Not what we want. Alright, Weep and Bell. Let's see what Weep and Bell can do here. What? Are... I keep pressing Q on accident. I'm a dummy. Double team. Okay, that's a good thing. It doesn't kill me. 
Oh, that's bad. Okay. Um, let's bring out Geodude for just a hot minute, just to get him some XP. I hope he just doesn't get slaughtered. Oh no, he has high. Yep, he has high defense. That's fine. Yeah, let's go ahead and um. Go ahead and bring War Turtle. Let's just end this right here. Use Tail Whip. That's okay. All right, water Gun. And why isn't he using Thunder moves? Those would hurt a lot. Okay, cool. You get a little bit of XP to everyone. Pidgeotto, War Turtle, and Geodude. Right, what about you, bud? Who's there? Quit listening on us. I don't know, man. It's kind of fun. Just one? You just gotta. S Oh, your Squirtle's level 20. Why don't you evolve it, you weirdo? Alright, let's gust it. Oh, am I dead? Alright, all right, let's... Um... Weep and Bell it is. Let's get Weep and Bell in here. Let's get some Bullet Seed going. Withdraw? Okay. I was like, where are you going? <laughs> There's nowhere you can go. Pull a seat. Alright. It's not, it's not doing a crazy amount of damage, but... Ooh. Okay. Killed him in three. That's pretty good. Alright, Pidgeotto and Weeping Bell. Go to level 22. Camper Ricky. All right, we got one more. Oh, we got all right, we got three more fights. All right, um, who do we bring out? Switch War Turtle back in. Um, yeah, that's fine because we'll, hopefully we'll be. Uh, I can't hit another gym until after SSN, right? You know what? No. Let's. I take that back. Let's go ahead and put Needle King in. Yeah, because Needle King's only 23. He still has some leveling to go before hitting. And again, I'm pretty sure I'll, I'll get rid of that 30 cap in a minute here by going to the next gym, but I just don't want to get myself in a position where I can't use War Turtle. Butterfree? It's actually pretty cool that he has one at level 20. Ooh. Supersonic, we missed. Alright, thrash him, Needle King. Cool. It's a good bit of XP, too. Cool. Alright, Bud Catcher. My bad. Alright, let's fight these two. Me? Well, okay, I'll play. How many? Please tell me you have like one. Oh, you have three. Oh, why do you have so many? All right, let's go ahead and just keep using Thrash. Thrash seems to work pretty well. Seems to kill them all in one turn. Where's my phone at? While I'm doing this, I surely should like. Um. Check if anyone in real life needs me. Doesn't look anyone needs me as of this moment. I think there's like a couple of replies I need to message back, but that's fine. Oh, I'm confused. I'm so confused. There we go. Not bad, Needle King, not bad. All right, one more battle before... Huh, you want to talk to me? One more battle before... We go ahead and do... Go go to Vermilion. Or, Vermilion? We might not be at Vermilion yet. I always forget the names of the towns. Go ahead and use Thrash. 
Only two, so this should be able to get us there. Okay, is, wait, what'd you say? Is that Eradicate or... Oh, Eradicate. Okay, that still won't save you, but that's pretty cool. Go level 25. Alright, Jeff. It's, this stinks. I couldn't beat your challenge. Sorry, Jeff. Vermilion, this is Vermilion. Okay. Very cool. I'm putting up a building on this plot of land. I own it all. My Pokemon is stomping the land to lay foundation. Okay, so we got our Mart here. We got a thing there. We're careful about pollution here. We've heard Grimer multiplies a toxic sludge. Did you see the SSN more in the harbor? Yes, that will be where we go next, I think. I'm the fishing guru. I simply love fishing. I can't bear to go without it. Tell me, do you like to fish? I do. Grand, grand I like your style. I think we can be friends. Take this and fish, young friend. Received old rod. Okay. Fishing is a way of life. It's like the finest poetry. From the seas to rivers. Go out and and land the big one, my friend. Will do. Um, probably next episode here, we'll probably try to catch some of these cool Pokemon. I know we'll definitely... Uh, first thing we gotta get is probably a Magikarp. I think that's basically all we can get for a while, I think, is the Magikarp. I don't know if we can get any other ones. Once we get the good rod, we can start getting Krabbies and Horsies and stuff like that, but... Um, okay. So we can go down... So we can... Okay, what are all these buildings? Let's go to this one. Hi, do you have a Spearow? Wanna trade it for my Farfetch'd? I do, actually. Let me go grab my Spearow. Alright, let's trade. Hi, do you have a Spearow? Wanna trade it for my Farfetch'd? Yes. Go ahead, take my level 5 Spearow. Spearow will be sent to whatever her name was. I wasn't fast enough. Bing bong. And this shows how you trade Pokemon. And we get a Farfetch'd. Alyssa. Chiding? That's his name, Chiding. Take good care of Chiding. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, what level is Chiding? Level 5? What do you got in your hand there, bud? Received stick. Um, you could probably have your stick back, to be honest. I don't know what the stick does. Oh, yeah, okay. The ting was given the stick. Yeah, yeah, let's give it back the stick, because it's an item only for Farfetch'd. Alright, let's go ahead and go to the Pokemart. Let's buy some things. Hi there, may I help you buy? Um, let's go ahead and buy... 10? Yeah, let's go ahead and buy 10 of those. We'll go ahead and buy two Super Potions. Um, let's go ahead and buy... 5 more Antidotes. A couple of Paralyzed Heals. Um, I want more than one. Let's go ahead and buy four. I don't need Awakening, Ice Heal. Let's buy a few Repels. Although I'm not gonna use them, I'm gonna- let's just buy them. Let's buy one Ice Heal. Okay, and I think we'll be fine with that. Is there anything else? Um, no, I'm good. Okay, so we got a little bit more to explore. What is this? Did we already... I'm like... Okay, no, we haven't gone in here. I'm getting my Pidgey to fly a letter to Saffron in the north. Okay. I want to exchange mail with all sorts of people. I send my Pidgey to a union room to exchange mail. Alright, guys. Uh, we're going to go ahead and check out this building and... Wait. I can probably cut this. We'll go ahead and check out everything in the next episode. Guys, if you enjoyed, make sure to like and comment, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.